Big game breakdown continues. Live odds go to sbrodds.sportsbookreview.com. The, the uh, second game of the doubleheader on TNT, 7.30 Pacific. Warriors try to sweep the Blazers. Golden State is 7, 220 the total. 121 to 109, 110 to 81, and 119 to 113, the big comeback on Saturday night. No Kurt. Durant's questionable. So was Livingston. And the Blazers had a 13-point halftime lead, and this has been a problem the entire season. They had 67 points at the half and then fell apart in the second half. Golden State outscored them 65 to 46. First half, Lillard and McCollum, 39 points combined. Curry and Thompson, 22. Portland won the boards 23 to 12. Second half, Lillard and McCollum, 24. Curry and Thompson, 36. Golden State won the boards 24 to 18. Now, it's Mike Brown again. And who knows when Kerr is coming back, Teddy. What does this mean for Golden State if, not, if they might not have the, 2000, the uh, coach of the year a couple years ago? Yeah, I mean, certainly Mike Brown is not a coach who either you or I has seen a lot of that we admire <laughs> in their career. And certainly... Steve Kerr has earned our admiration given the success that he's had both in the regular season and in the playoffs coaching this particular Warriors squad. So there is something of a drop-off there. The question is how much, how do you quantify it? Is it worth a half point? Is it worth two points? I think it's worth something. Here's a quote from Kerr about his status. This is not going to be a case where I'm coaching one night and not coaching the next. I'm not going to do that to our team, to our staff. We're hoping that over the next week or two or whatever it is, I can start to make a definitive realization, a reduction, or just feel like I'm going to do this or not. So it certainly sounds serious for Steve Kerr, whatever the health problems are, but are we going to see him back in this series? Probably not. Certainly not if Golden State wins tonight. Well, I don't know. It's a, it's, he's, an, he's an excruciating pain, and it's because of these symptoms from the back surgery. And he said, any advice to people with back pain, don't get surgery. Tiger Woods just had his fourth surgery as well, so he's nauseous, and uh, he's trying to talk to a doctor. But uh, interesting quote there that if, if he's not going to come back for one game and then sit, and that's the right thing to do. Now, the Warriors, the last thing they need is another weapon. Look at McGee. Plus 24 in the 15 minutes he played in Game 3. Only 39 minutes in the series, but 35 points, 14 rebounds, 6 blocks, and 2 steals. He's 16 of 19 from the field. Most of those dunks of players that played at least 700 minutes this season only Embiid averaged more blocks per minute than McGee. Nurkic came back, two points, but 11 rebounds, four assists, and a block shot. He played in 16 minutes. Portland was plus one with him on the court, not expected to play. Now, what, what is Lillard and McCollum? What do they have to work with on offense, and does it impact their defense? Warriors only seven turnovers, tied a franchise low, and we'll see if there's enough in the tank for those two for four quarters. And really... What's the motivation? Try to get inside the head of the athlete here. Are they going to win the series? No. Will they win game five on the road? No. So if the going gets tough early, wonder if they'll pack it in because they're going to get eliminated anyways. Here's Stotts about the Warriors. They took it up to another level. They defended very well, created turnovers, or offense stagnated. They push it out in transition as well as they have so far in the series. It's what they do. Put a run on you, end quote. And he's right about that. I mean, this team... What is it, six, six times they've been down 15 points in the playoffs the last few years, come back to win, and they did it again. That's the TNT doubleheader. Hey, guys, for the full video, go to sbrpicks.com. Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to our channel. Now we've put a lot of work into producing all these free videos, so please help us out and keep all our content free for you forever by simply liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing. Now not to mention a visit to our industry leading website will warm the hearts of all our SBR employees, especially myself. Now the links are over there to the left, uh, so do check those out. Thanks for watching.